So now I'm going to start showing you how to actually just use the uh, different documents uh, in Google Docs, which are document, spreadsheet, and presentation. So I'll start with a document. To create a new one, I'm just going to go to the new drop-down menu and click document. And it opens up in a new window or tab, depending on your web browser. And then here it is. Here's what the uh, just document looks like. And again, this is just pretty much like a Word document. So you can start typing. Okay, and uh, first you probably want to save it, and you can do that from File, Save, or Save up here. And actually Google will also will automatically start saving after a while and uh, apply this, this right here as the, uh, the title, but let me just go ahead and save it. And you can see it there, there when it actually just automatically saved it. I know it's saved because um, it this is the title right here. And if I wanted to rename it later, I already showed you how to rename it, and I can also just click right here to rename it. But if you just want to automatically save when you first start, again, go to File, Save, or Save Up Here. Now I'm going to talk about the Edit Toolbar. Um, and it kind of looks like a little tab like this. It's by default what comes up first. And then you've got your pretty much the same stuff you have on any like word processor program. Here's an undo and the redo last edit, and little scissors for cut, and then you've got copy and paste. And then you can alter your text with these. Uh, if I just highlight the text, I've got bold, italic, and underline, and you can see they, they change color when they're on and go back to normal when I turn them off. Uh, here you've got your different fonts, and right now these are the fonts that are available. They, they probably add more as time goes on. You can change the text size right here. Um, you can change the color of the text and then the highlight of the text. You can see it's orange text with the black highlight now. And here's the, the hyperlink, but I'm going to show you how to use that in another clip actually. You can create a numbered list just like I just hit this, start typing. It's a numbered list. Hit space twice to get out of that. Uh, bullets, uh, it's the exact same thing, just with bullets. And then you've got indent less and indent more, which basically works kind of like what your tab key would work like if you were uh, in a document, but it stays indented. You can see that. If I indent more, it's going to stay indented. And then I can go back. And there's a little quote option, which should bring it up in a little quote box like that. And then you can justify left, uh, center, or right. And then if you want to just remove formatting, you would just highlight and then hit this little T with an X on it to remove all the formatting of what you highlighted. So that's the, the edit toolbar uh, on a Google document. And I'll go into more detail about how to hyperlink and then look at the style and changing uh, in the following clips.